How much does a press base camp track cost? What is the best way to plan the itinerary? What kind of difficulties trackers need to face while on the track? Altitude sickness can be a big issue or not. When is the best time to go? What about food and accommodation facilities? Is there any special trekking gear that you must have on the track? Let's talk about it. On the way to Everest Base Camp track, you will enjoy every single minute of magnificent vistas which also include gorgeous forest, rivers, valley, green hills and a massive Himalayan range. The panoramic view of the Himalayas won't let you blink your eyes. Every step you climb, you will get better view. When you reach the base camp, you will feel like you are in heaven, surrounded by the snow-capped mountains. I can assure you that each and every moment you spend on track will be a memorable one. Well, most of the trekkers follow the same route Lukla, Namche, Tangboche, Dingboche, Labuche, Gorakshep and Base Camp. Then trek back down the same route all the way to Lukla. But some part of the trek you may take alternative routes, different trail on the way up and different trail on the way down. Trekking by a Mongla, Khorche, Upper Pangboche route is one of the best scenic routes on the way to a Brisbane base camp, which is followed by fewer trekkers only. You should give it a try this route. I'm sure you're gonna love it. And trek back down by a Tangboche route. Usually most of the trekkers complete the 120 km trek in 11 days, including two acclimatization days. But if you can aid one or two extra days then the trek would be easy going and you will get more time to explore the Khumbu region. If you can add another 2 to 3 days to explore the Gokyo Valley will be like the cherry on top. For more details you may contact us. Every space camp trek is a challenging trek due to thin air and lack of oxygen. But trekking wise is not that challenging. Most of the trekking days involve long rocky paths that go uphill and downhill and 4 to 7 hours walking. Every space camp trek doesn't demand any advanced physical fitness level. Anyone with good health and positive mindset can go for this trek. However, you will have to do some specific training to appreciate and enjoy the stunning Himalayan adventure. For training ideas, you may check my other video, link in the description. Altitude sickness is a major issue on the Everest Base Camp track, but it is possible to avoid. Whichever trek you do, trekking above 3000 meter, there's always a chance to get altitude sickness in the Himalayas. So every trekker must follow these simple rules to avoid altitude sickness. Trek slow, drink more fluids, have enough rest, and never push yourself. If you have all the symptoms, wait and see minimum a day. If you feel better, carry on. If not, it's time to trek down before it gets worst. Mountains are always there. Health is more important. Autumn season, September to November, and spring season, March to May, are the best season for every space camp trek. The weather is sunny and warm with outstanding views. If you wish to avoid crowds and enjoy some peaceful time with the nature, then taking this trip during the winter is also possible. In monsoon season, June to August, it's possible to do a trekking, but be ready to get wet and face the cloudy weather. The guest house is comfortable. The beds have mattress, pillows and blankets, but they do become more basic as you go higher. And every guest house provides hygienic food. Most of the trekkers like the food while on the trek. The food options are eggs, bread, 
soup, rice, noodle, spring rolls, pasta, momo, pizza, spaghetti, etc. Trekking to every space camp is a lifetime experience for many people. Like any other adventure, it requires preparation and planning, including deciding on what to pack for the trek. You must keep in mind which season you are going to trek while packing your trekking gear. The weather can be dramatically changed up in the mountain while you ascend or descend. So the layer on or off is very important. Please check my other video to know more about what to pack for every space camp trek. Link in the description. Every space camp trekking cost is affordable for all adventure lovers. And it depends on the number of days you are spending in Nepal, the number of days you are staying in the city, the number of days you will be on the trek, the number of people in a group, joining an international company or local company, standard of accommodation you are taking, etc. So it would be difficult to give you an exact cost. Just for the basic idea, it may cost USD 1200 to above. Keep hiking, keep exploring. If you need more information, feel free to contact me. We'll provide all the information and we'll help you to organize the trip as you want. Cheers. See you in the Himalayas.